Hello everyone, welcome back to Real Life. I hope you're having a great day. Thank you to all the subscribers and members. There's plenty of members only episodes to enjoy and more to come. Your support is appreciated. Today's episode is a look back at the brand new and still very much under construction neighborhood of Sundance in the deep south end of Calgary in the spring of 1990 and a brief look at Fish Creek Park and its two main crossings. Please forgive the rather poor 270 lines of resolution of the three quarter inch umatic tape and three tube camera combo. My second camera some 35 years ago. It was pretty good at the time. How far we've come. Lake Bonavista was built in the late 1960s, the first community in Canada to be built around a man-made lake, and it served as a prototype for other lake communities in Calgary. Its success spawned Lake Bonaventure, Lake Mindapore, and of course Sundance. Today, there are numerous man-made lake communities in Calgary. Sundance was established in 1982 during the recession and downturn. As a result, it would grow more slowly than communities in the 1970s. Note the City of Calgary flag flying lakefront. It was created by Gwyneth Llewellyn and Yvonne Fritz, a former Legislative Assembly of Alberta member and adopted in 1983. Points of reference are challenging to establish as everything is so new. I suspect some sharp-eyed viewers may recognize intersections and homes. There are always clues. The lakefront homes should be much easier to identify. Today, some 30 years later, it has matured. Its saplings are now majestic trees. Calgary's population in 1990 was a mere 738,000 people, less than half of today.
The brief view of Fish Creek focuses on the CPR bridge and McLeod Trail before the addition of the LRT bridge and the widening of McLeod Trail. The usually docile and quiet Fish Creek is flowing a little faster with spring runoff beginning. Enjoy. <laughs>